Hello, welcome to Allstate. Your admissions rep will be right with you. Hello, prospective student. My name is Russell, director of admissions here at Allstate Career. I'm gonna show you around. Follow me. The front desk area here. your uniforms here. So for medical billing and coding, this is the uniform shirt you'd wear once we have classes on campus. Uh, this is your uh, scrub for pharmacy tech. This is your medical assistant scrub and your dental assistant scrub. So again, you'll feel like you're actually in the medical field when you have your uniforms on. And this, way. this is our job board. Um, as you can see, some students have gotten jobs in the field. This young lady got a job as a pharmacy tech at Essex Pharmacy and Surgical. Um, these are a list of all of our other students who've gotten jobs. So we're getting people jobs in medical assisting, medical billing and coding, dental assisting. Those are our four programs. Come this way. Our graduate spotlight board. So this highlights, you know, some of our students who graduated uh, this past year. Um, and we have them by program, uh, dental assisting, medical assisting, billing and coding, pharmacy tech, HVAC, as well as our CDL drivers. Uh, so again, when you graduate, the whole school gets to see your name on this list. Now, your success is our success. So this is our academic, academic achievement board. Um, Dean's list means you made a B in your class. Also, we have president's list. So you're eligible to get these certificates and these are really huge resume boosters. Guys, we do a financial aid. Uh, this is our financial aid board here. Financial aid is made up of two things, grants and loans. That's our financial aid. Uh, we do accept uh, you know, scholarships. And we also have work study available. Uh, we have a team here, financial aid representatives, uh, that will help you out um, to make sure your financial needs are met. Okay guys, so this is our student resources board. We have a lot of resources for our students. Number one, if you're gonna be taking a bus to school, we sell monthly bus passes for about 55 bucks per month. Uh, if you need any insurance and you live in Maryland, this is a contact number for you to you know, apply for some insurance. We have a service called Well Connect that's available for our students 24 seven, seven days a week. Some of the things they help with are, you know, lifestyle things like uh, daily living expenses, childcare, legal issues, financial issues, uh, anything like that. And it's actually for faculty and staff. Um, and it's available, you know, 24-7, seven, seven days a week. Uh, if you do need tutoring, we offer free tutoring as well. Um, and once you actually register for school, we'll set you up with mycampuslink.com. That's how you guys will be able to get online and look at your attendance, your schedule, your grades, your GPA, financial aid, pretty much your life as a student will be on mycampuslink.com. And that's something that your admissions rep will set up with you, okay? All the classes are actually on the second floor. So we're gonna go upstairs. Let's keep going. All right, so these are our core values. Uh, number one is integrity, uh, student focus outcomes, commitment, service, excellence, and respect. These are the values of our company, and again, we want your academic success, okay? Now, this is uh, Allstate Career uh, LRC, so it's the Learning Resource Center, so come on in. Uh, we have extra books over here, Three, guys. Five. Um, some of our different graduating classes from Allstate over the years, okay? okay. Um, these computers over sure here are for your leisure. You can use these computers over here. Um, we have an online library yep. that you can log into. And you can print over here and uh, you okay. can print as much as you like, okay? Yes. So this is our career services board here. So this here says extern sites that hire. So depending on what program you're doing, you're either gonna be on a 12 week externship or a six week externship. And these are some sites that actually hire. So for all of our programs, these are some of the sites that hired them. For dental assisting, Cool Smiles is a, is a dental uh, office that hired them. Dental Dreams, uh, Navy Sandana, Bell Air Smart Keepers, just to name a few. For medical assisting, we have Mercy Medical Center, Mercy Hospital, First Medical of Annapolis. For medical billing and coding, we have Med First Claims Management, uh, Med Star Health, uh, the Mandela Center. For pharmacy tech, you can work at a retail location, Giants Pharmacy, Patterson Park Pharmacy, University of Maryland Hospital. Uh, these are some places that have actually hired our students when they're done. So remember, when you do your externship, guys, take that last six week or 12 week semester, uh, uh, module of school seriously because you could get possibly hired from your site. This is our uh, career services department. 
Okay. This is uh, my director of career services, Ms. Reese Phillips. Hi. Uh, so, you know, when you need help with your resume skills, your interview skills, uh, her department will help you with that that job placement at the end of all of this. How you doing, Sharice? How you doing? Good. Okay. Now, Sharice's team is right here. She has Ms. Pam, she has Taryn, uh, she has Kelly. She has a team of three individuals that helps you guys with your resume skills, your interview okay, skills, and again, helping you uh, when it comes to getting that, that that job opportunity okay. at the end of all of this. Uh, Ms. Jones, our business office manager, and Ms. Amanda, our business office associate as well. Uh, Dean of Education, Ms. Kimberly Stone. As you can see we have the pharmacy tech board here. A uh, couple of the books, pharmacy, Practice and Principles, also Pharmacology is a book that you guys will use. Uh, this is actually uh, some different drug names, the brand, generic, and classification. So you'll learn about different classifications of drugs. Over here is where we actually make certain ointments. You know, sometimes people can't swallow pills, so we make ointments and creams using some of these things like petroleum, petroleum jelly. Okay. Um, we have mock skills days here. So this is the traditional job up area. You got your production area or producing all the medicine. You got your pickup area for your customers. I always got your waiting area, okay? Um, behind the counter, you know, you got your, uh, your pill counter and trays. You got your, um, you know, your mixers, okay? So this is pretty much, uh, you know, pharmacy tech. Again, this is kind of something like a retail pharmacy. So you got your different, um, control substances or substances, you know, by different classifications. So if you are a retail pharmacy tech, you, this would be your, your arena where you'd be at, okay? Okay guys, this is our dental assisting program, actually expanded functions dental assisting. Come on in. So over here we have your different equipment that you'd be using. Uh, these are actually some trays um, or molds of students' teeth that were made here on campus by the students. So you get a chance to actually do a mold of your own teeth just to know what kind of foundation that you have in your mouth, okay? Um, over here, these are some of our sample teeth that students get in their tuition. You get a chance to practice on some of these. Um, you will learn anatomy of the teeth, um, disorders of the jaw. Over here, we have all your dental chairs. Um, so as you can see, um, we have pretty much everything that you would see uh, in a dental lab. Um, so this is a lot of hands-on training guys so you get a lot of hands-on training in this class come this way most of our classrooms are small so very small classroom sizes so you know once you get into this class as you can see you can't hold any people probably be a very small amount of students in here we also offer radiology as a part of your uh, dental assisting um, certification so over here um, we have the radiology vest we have a trifold here where you'll be doing sample um, you know, pictures of students' teeth. This is the instructions on how to put a bite mark in the student's mouth, okay? So you can get that good x-ray picture. Over here, we have the, an autoclave. Um, so with the autoclave, we basically would teach you how to sterilize the instruments, okay? Um, and then over here is where we have um, our dark room, okay? So not only do we teach you how to develop the film, but we also te uh, take the picture, excuse me, but we also teach you how to develop those films so you can get an, a nice, clear picture, okay? Yeah, so this is our medical assisting classroom, the clinical class. We got your front desk office set up here. Again, medical assistants do front office and back office, so have that area over here. Um, have your different instruments that you'll be using here. You will learn how to tube blood. Okay. Also, you learn how to draw blood. So these are blood drawing stations for our medical assisting students. So you sitting here, for example, have all your different uh, equipment here, your gloves, your alcohol pads, you know, your tourniquets, all that stuff. It's right here um, behind me. Okay. Now, also in the medical assisting field, you're going to learn how to do what we call EKGs or ECGs. Okay. So when you're doing an EKG, this is where the placement goes. So V1 through V6 would go here. And then the rest of the uh, things would go here, okay? And this measures the electricity in your heart. So again, have a sample here, dummy here. Uh, this is a dummy arm, okay? So as a medical assistant, you will have to feel for veins and stuff like that when you're drawing blood. Uh, scale for height and weight, okay? Um, for the clinical class, 
for your V, your V line test, okay? Um, this is a dummy arm here. Um, and this is actually water here. So you have to get a feel for how the blood actually flows when you draw the blood, okay? Have our CPR dummies over here. Uh, hand washing station, again, autoclave. I'm gonna teach you how to sterilize instruments. This is used for our, our urine test. So these are for urine strips, okay? Also a manual urine station if you wanna test urine manually. And then these are uh, two female and male dummies. So this is a male inside out and this is a female, okay? But in the medical clinical classroom, it's gonna be a lot of hands-on learning here. So you're gonna know how to do that those duties of a medical assistant once you actually start your job, okay? Hey guys, so this is our medical building and coding classroom. Very small class. We have our lead uh, medical building and coding instructor, Ms. Rawlings in here. How you doing today? So Ms. Rawlings, what can you tell us about medical building and coding? When it comes to medical and building and coding, it is everybody that comes into the doctor's office, hospital, wherever practice it is. We are the ones that's gonna get you paid. So make sure all the services are answered right and the medical and building and coding will handle it from there. All right, prospective student, can you see yourself as part of the Allstate family? If so, getting started is up to you.